Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn the basic ladder programming concepts. Before starting the program, we need to understand the PLC. PLC is a programmable logic controller which monitors the inputs and based on the control logics, it will generate the output. The control logics can be programmed through different programming languages such as ladder logic, sequential flowchart, function block diagram, structured text and instruction list. The most common and popular language is ladder logic diagram which the program looks like a ladder with different input and outputs. In ladder logics, it will start from the left to right and top to the bottom corresponding to the power lines. Each correspondence lines are called runs. Let us start with the ladder logic basics which is normally open and normally closed contacts. The digital input be mapped with the logical input. The signals from the field can be taken either normally open or normally closed signals. In normally open condition, if the input is not energized, then the state is zero. When the input is energized, then the state become one. For the normally closed signal, it is reversed. In normally closed condition, if the input is energized, then the state becomes 1. When the input is opened, then the states become 0. Let us try with AND gates. If you see this drawing, both input A and B are connected in series with the lamp as output. Let's see the truth table. If you see both inputs are 0, then output becomes 0. If any of the input is 0 as well as the output becomes 0. If both inputs are 1 then output becomes 1. Similarly if you go for OR gate both inputs are connected in parallel along with the output. Let's see the truth table. If both inputs are 0 then the output becomes 0. If any one of the input is 1 then the output becomes 1. If the both inputs are 1 then the output becomes 1 also. Let's start with the PLC program. Add normally open contact as input and the coil as output. Then we can add the tag for the input bit as percentage m0.0 .0 and output coil as percentage m0.1. Both memory bits automatically created and stored in the PLC tags. Let's try for our case. Both inputs should be connected with parallel. So I can add the second input in parallel along with the first input and named as percentage m0.2. Then we named as OR logic. Now we will move to AND logics. Add two inputs along with one output coil and named as percentage m0.3 percentage m0.4 for inputs and percentage m0.5 for output coil. Now we completed the AND logic and OR logic as per the gates. Let's start the simulation. Now we are in online mode. If you observe the left rung as green color, this means the power lines moved up to the normally open contract. Just simulate the input percentage m0.0 to 1 then the output becomes 1 because both inputs are connected in parallel. If any one of the input is on, then the output becomes on. Now we will move to the AND gates. If the input number 1 is on in AND gates, this will not generate any output because both the inputs are connected in series. So it will need to run the second input as well. Now both inputs are on. So the output becomes 1. This is called AND logics. If you understand that how to connect the AND and OR gates, this means you know the basic concepts and you know that how to work with basic ladder logics. I hope you understand the basic programming concept such as normally open and close contract along with the AND and OR logics. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, kindly press the like button and share to your network. Thank you.